Hey everyone, Dylan Schumacher, Citadel Defense, and it's time for that yearly everyday carry review. So about once a year, I like to try to do a video to check in on kind of my current everyday carry setup. Uh, if you're anything like me, different stuff might rotate in and rotate out. You might try some stuff out and then ditch it or whatever. Like there's a variety of things that can contribute to that. So I just kind of want to do a once a yearly check in to say this is where I'm at and this is what I'm doing now and it might help you, it might not. And I don't really care what you think I should carry. This is just what I happen to do. So, uh, starting from that, the first thing, of course, right, is a gun of some sort. So, right now I carry a Glock 19 I have for a while, uh, and this is in a Filster holster. Um, on here I have a TLR7, I have an RMR on there, and then I have some just backup iron sights. Uh, I also have this little fancy Magpul um, Magwell extender thing. It makes your reloads so much smoother because you can just feel it right in there. Um, I like that a lot. I should have got that a long time ago. That's probably the best $30 upgrade I've ever done to a gun. So would highly recommend that. Uh, second thing, I do carry a spare magazine on me um, because you know, you should have one of those. So I carry a Glock 17 mag. I carry it in this Kydex holster that is from Bravo Concealment. And honestly, it's my favorite uh, Kydex holster, um, extra mag carrier pouch thing, whatever, whatever we're calling those now. Um, I don't even know if they make this anymore. I think they make them out of like custom mold and plastic right now, but the retention on this thing is just, it's just perfect. It's just the perfect amount of retention. I mean, it's obviously not going to fall out of there. Uh, big, big fan of this. I don't know if they make these anymore, but if they don't, they should make them. As far as a belt goes, I've been carrying the same belt now for a long, long time. It's probably like three or maybe plus years. This is the Tejas gun belt El Original by Magpul. Uh, again, it's the most kind of like everyday looking kind of carry belt. So it doesn't look garish or tactical or anything. It just looks like a brown belt, but it's got enough thickness in here uh, that it can support what I need. It also, because I've been wearing it for so long now, it's, it's, it's pretty loose, not like loose in a, um, not gonna carry the weight, but loose in a very comfortable uh, way. So great belt, highly recommend it if you're interested in that. Uh, for utility, I do carry a little mini Streamlight, the Streamlight Mark Micro. Uh, this thing is USB, oh, here it is, there it is. USB rechargeable, which is great. So this is a perfect little utility light. Big fan of this, would recommend it just for utility tasks. For a proper like defensive light, I carry the Streamlight Protac 2LX. Um, it's like 500 lumens. There are better lights now. now. This thing has rolled faithfully in my pocket for several years now. Uh, would recommend it. Again, there are better lights out there, but if this thing's like 50 bucks, 45 bucks, and for the money to performance ratio, it's, it's fantastic. So would recommend that. Other than that, um, I carry a Leatherman. I carry the Leatherman Wingman. Uh, big fan of this deal. I, I use it every day, all day. Um, fantastic little just multi-tool stuff. And that's really it. Uh, I started wearing a watch now. I don't know if that counts, but this is a Nixon staple, I think is, is what I roll with for that. So I've been kind of experimenting with that a little bit. I don't carry any defensive blades or, or things like that usually. Um, and that's it. I, that's my current everyday carry, aside from, you know, phone, wallet, all the other boring stuff that who really needs to hear about that. So hope that gives you some ideas. Hope that helps you out. So that's it. That's what I'm carrying. Love to hear what you got. Do brave deeds and endure.